Forever Legends proudly recognizes the astonishing career of professional baseball player Willie the Devil Wells. Born in August of 1906, Wells, an Austin, Texas native, grew up to be a tremendous athlete. He would attend the historic PVIL institution of Anderson High School in which he would hone his craft as one of the greatest baseball players to come from the program. Wells began his professional baseball career in 1923, playing one season for the Austin Black Senators, a minor league team in the Negro National League. He would briefly attend Sam Houston College before being called up to the St. Louis Stars of the Negro National League. During his historic career, Wells would go on to play for 11 major league Negro teams, including the likes of the Homestead Grays, the Kansas City Monarchs, and the Birmingham Black Barons. Wells also spent time playing professional baseball in Cuba, Canada, and Mexico. His fiercely competitive nature led to the fans of Mexico bestowing upon him his infamous nickname of El Diablo, which was later translated in the United States to The Devil. Wells' contributions to the game of baseball include being credited as the first baseball player to wear a batting helmet in a game after sustaining the concussion with the Newark Eagles, and he's also credited with teaching the great Jackie Robinson how to turn a double play. Wells passed away in 1989 in his hometown of Austin, Texas. The 10-time All-Star and two-time Cuban League MVP was inducted into the Major League Baseball Hall of Fame in 1997. Wells is credited with a career 319 batting average. It is with great honor that Forever Legends recognizes PVIL legend Willie the Devil Wells.